today, Hamaya Haven celebrated their journey over the past year since we set up our organisation. Hamaya Haven has been recognised by the police and probation services. Today, we had a launch and official open day for our new office. To mark the event, we had amazing speakers with special guest Alison Cope, mother of rapper Joshua Ribera, known as Depsman, who was fatally stabbed in 2013. I just want to say thank you for inviting me to the launch of Hermea Haven. Uh, my name is Alison Cope and I'm here today to support an amazing cause, helping families and young people who, you know, we don't usually support. So it's really good to see the community coming together and helping these people in such a positive way. And I will support them along the journey in the best way I can. So thank you very much for inviting me today. Hello, Police Sergeant Marina Dane from Birmingham Partnership Team from West Midlands Police. Um, with the overview for vulnerability and early help for Birmingham. Um, the inception of Himaya Haven has been a fantastic opportunity for us to have somebody to refer individuals into where we've got young people and families who've got people incarcerated they've not been able to contact or to identify support for um, hidden sentences um, that we can uh, offer all sorts of different options for them to come and speak and make contact with their relatives whilst they're in custody. Himaya Haven is working to support the families of loved ones in prison. We shared case studies of the impact on families and how communities need to work together as said by Reverend Dr Desmond Jadu. Amazing year for me and Razzie and Zobia. We've worked tirelessly to try and get our name out there to meet beautiful people. We've had 19 cases since we've started and we look forward to working in the community and helping many, many families in the future. Thank you. Hello, it's Pritesh Chohan from JD Spicer Solicitors. I was very pleased to be part of the event today. The launch went extremely well um, and I wish the organisation the very best. Thank you very much. Today we've been at Hamaya Haven, we've had the launch party and we've had an and um, some different perspectives, especially from older people being young. With it's nice to know what kind of the older generation think of the current situation that's going on in the community. And it's been a nice kind of day. Just met a lot of people, we've seen a lot of different um, ideas, and it's been really good. Dr. Karamat Iqbal spoke about how he thought that it was a pioneering and courageous organisation tackling taboo subjects within the community. Hi, today we had a launch and open day for Hamaya Haven. We had speakers from different uh, cities, from uh, like Alison Cope came, talked about her effects. Um, it's been really uh, effective. We had a good turnout. And uh, thank you for everyone that have supported us with funding. We had sponsors where we took uh, prayer mats to prison and we have an office space given to us by Green Court Nursery and we, we work with families and we're trying to show how important it is to work with families that are affected by prison and the support and how communities should work together to make this project work, work and, and succeed and thank you everybody so much.